Hi, I'm Rachel Greninger with Red Carpet Report, and tonight we're at the Casting Society of America's Ardios Awards, the annual celebration where we talk about all things casting directors and celebrate the ones who have won this year. Excellent. How are you? I'm well. How are you? Thank you. I like your microphone. Thank yeah. It's shiny. <laughs> no, it is. It's like jewelry. Yeah. It literally, and then I have actual jewelry. Oh my God! I don't need any. I don't need any kind of supportive app. I have this guy right here. Me. This is myself. Damn. Good. Thank you. Most of it, less than fifty dollars. Nice. Very nice. Same. Same. None of this is mine. So oh, right. Stuff that is mine is under fifty. You're a curator. I. I you guess. Collect so. good things. Yeah. I, I, yeah. I like that. Yeah. I love this jacket, though. Thank you very much. Yeah. It's Tom Ford. It's very. It's also very Zoolander. You know what? I do feel Zoolander. Like, yeah, like you know, it's coming out. Maybe that's why he put me in it, cause you know. And then you've got the turtleneck too. Can you throw a blue steel? Right. I can't even. I, there's no even. We don't even need to do any other interviews. We have this. The blue steel. So, what are you? Are is there anybody here tonight you're really looking forward to seeing? Yes, uh, Edie Belasco, right over there. She's uh, nominated for two awards. She's uh, our casting director from Transparent, and um, she's done obviously many other things. But yeah, that's why we're here tonight. I'm on the show with her, Kiersey and uh, Emily. So yeah. Uh, so Transparent so. is definitely dealing with a lot of stuff that's really relevant right sure. now, specifically. Yeah. Um, what are some of the feedback that you've seen from fans of the show that's really been? inspiring for you? Oh, um, honestly, it's all been positive, uh, fortunately, which has been great. Uh, I haven't had anybody come up to me that's been, like, you know, hating on it or, you know, being, like, really closed-minded. Um, it's all been really great. I think it's opening up a lot of doors for everybody, really, not just trans people, but um, people of all different races and genders and just, you know, it's great. So, um, and it's been amazing because it's, I've never worked on anything like that before. You know, it's uh, the collaborative people on it are from all different walks of life and culture, and it's been amazing. It's just like a big melting pot, and it's one of the friendliest sets I've ever been on in my life. So it's been really great. So coming from somebody who's gotten cast in a show, and now you're at an award show for uh, yeah. people who casted you yeah. and, and other people, um, do you have any advice for people or talent or people that are grinding out there who, to get that that you oh, can give to them? Even if it's maybe something wise someone said to you, that's okay too. Uh, I mean, yeah, there's been a lot of tidbits over the years. Um, hard work always pays off. Um, just being nice, you know, like just, and always it's all perspective, you know, when you're struggling and if you're looking at it like, you know, like you're struggling, you know, the whole glass is half empty, glass is half full thing. You got to keep that positive attitude. Not to be corny, but it's true, you know. It's about gratefulness. Yeah, abundance flows, you know. If you're focusing on negative stuff, and then more negative stuff's going to come. Focus on positive stuff, positive stuff just comes. Well, there's so much. It's not like there's a, there's never a place that you can get to where there's too much or you can't get any more. Right. Like, there's always an abundance of everything. Too many good things. Yeah, that'd be nice to have. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Congratulations. Have a great rest of the night. Thanks for stopping. Thank you. you too. Thanks for watching, and if you like my interviews, hit like, subscribe, and in the comments below, tell me what your favorite villain this year was.